All right, we're recording. As you prepare to yeah, Loud, 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 loud. Right. Okay, go. We've taken to the streets of San Diego as we release our first all California edition of 2015. All right, you ready? It's a big one. La Metro takes us all over the world over the course of a year. But as a Californian, and a new one at that, I'm always incredibly excited about the collections that showcase my own home state. Okay. The six wines in this set are all from California and they're all Zinfandel, but they're not all quite what you're expecting. All right, go. A lot of people would see the words Zinfandel and say, wait a minute, you mean that sweet stuff? And frankly, until tasting the wines that went into this box, I would have been one of them. Okay. Whenever we do a La Metro collection about one variety, the point is to show how much can be done from one grape. In this case, I think you'll see there's a lot more to Zinfandel than what you've been led to believe. Okay, go. There are some wines in this edition that you may be familiar with or at least have read about, such as Turley Wine Cellars. And then there's things like Hobo Wine Company that were a surprise for me myself to find. These six wines are nothing if not dynamic. I'm totally recording now. How are you? Yeah. <laughs> Should I be speaking? If you want to, that'd be awesome. <laughs> You'd be like a real reporter. You can tell it's planted throughout the state of California. In fact, the oldest vines that I'm familiar with are all Zinfandel. And there are wines in this box that go back at least 120 years. Okay, go. Besides the obvious quality of the wines in this collection, I think that the artwork itself really stands out. This is the first in a set of three paintings from Ray Ferrer that we'll be working with. Ready. We happen to be here in San Diego, but this is our chance to share California's best wines with you wherever you are. <laughs> 